Oh, where do I go? I want somewhere where you guys can kind of see me. Can you guys see me? Yeah, you can. Mm -mm. Right. Hey, guys. <laughs> Welcome back. Thank you for tuning in. Um, so, it's another sex vlog. Oh, yes. Um, no fucking shame. Yeah, we're coming in. We're dropping in. Um, so, currently at the station. En route to Swindon. Okay, we're going to meet a newbie. Um, yeah. Going to meet a newbie. So, yeah. Um... Mm, I'm just waiting for the train. It should get here like any minute, but I thought I'd quickly start the vlog. I'm gonna try and keep this one really short and brief and not like a, well, probably will end up being like 30 minutes. So yeah, but I hope you're all really well. I hope you're all well. Um, gosh, right, I've just like had a really fucking shit day today. I don't know, like it hasn't been, hasn't been the best. Yeah, I just had kind of a really shit day, guys. Like my mood and my energy is like not at an all time high yeah keeping it real we'll keep it very real over here but anyway i thought i'd just vlog because i do like it and it just does get me in the mood a little bit and i like talking to you guys yeah um can i just say by the way so i put like my most recent like, most recent last two vlogs like they've just literally gone through the roof and we've had like 1.2k views on some of them and the watch time is going through the roof so if you've watched thank you so much um yeah but it has also meant it has also meant, um, let me go over here. Nice. It's also meant that it's come with a lot more like, I don't know, hate, is that the word? Hate? Oh no, I don't know if, if I'd word, would I call it hate? It, it, people with different worldviews, um, yeah. I just don't really, uh, guys, I don't get you if you're the sort of person where <laughs> you absolutely would just shit on someone's video and just like, fair enough, share your worldview, but also don't do it in a way where it absolutely just belittles someone else and it puts you on like a pedestal and someone else not just because they're not living your life the way you would live it, right? Um, yeah, I just really don't get people like that. Like you would take the time to like comment shit. Yeah, like share it, fair enough, share your opinion. Like I'm, I'm clearly like I'm opening my life and like, and I'm sharing parts of my life with people. So I expect there is gonna be, there are gonna be people that don't agree with what I'm doing, you know? And it isn't for you guys, it isn't for people to agree. Like it's my life, it's your life, right? Live it in the way you feel like, and the way, live it in the way that you feel is like most aligned, right? Uh, but yeah, like, I don't know. So I think, yeah, this morning I woke up and I just kind of went <laughs> on the YouTube, on my YouTube and I was just like responding to people. But then like, there was just a few comments and I, I was actually just like, I was like, oh, okay, right, like, you know, it's just like, you, and then I, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I don't know, it's, I think it's just uh, contributed to my, like, my, oh, I'm just like a, a bit of a low. I mean, I'm a, a bit of a low today, yeah. Um, mm, yeah, so that, and also just I like, had a really shit day at work today. Um, and for those, any, any newbies, like I'm, I'm a mental health nurse, and like there are times where, I am working with people where they do just literally want to kill themselves. <laughs> um, it can be really tricky because um, for anyone that's also new here, I'm not like the biggest fan of conventional medicine when it comes to like managing um, ill health and stuff. Um, yeah. So it's just really difficult working day in, day out with people that are really suffering. And I don't know what we're actually doing about it apart from like, wishing them off with like a list of meds and like talking therapies that necessarily isn't everyone's root cause yeah so it's just it, i find it really difficult sometimes like i'm the sort of person like where i absolutely will care i care about like strange like i care about like i care about people like so i don't want i don't want to see people like suffer yeah like fair enough pain is a part of life but suffering that's another fucking that's another oh, i don't know oh yeah just i'm having it i'm struggling today <laughs> having a bit of a down day definitely i don't know yeah those two things have been just like yeah my work and also like some people in the comments section i'm just like oh fuck off <laughs> like, literally fuck off but also like not fuck off because you have a different like opinion your opinions are welcome but it's just like when you execute your opinion in a way where like i was saying earlier like where it just belittles someone else or like where respect is not in the picture and you're just coming in with like you know it, it, coming in with your worldview but it's just like you're kind of just like rude about it yeah like, it's like where are your basic manners <laughs> like i think language is really important and the way we speak is really important yeah and also there are lots of people that i know you don't watch the video but you literally just see the title and you watch like the first five fucking seconds and then you literally have formed an opinion yeah that's literally like opening up a book reading a fucking first page and going yep i've made my judgment about this book yep and this this is my opinion it's like oh my god really yeah 
I don't know, I feel like I just struggle. I struggle to conversate with people that are just like, your, your thinking is like, like, you just don't take time to think for yourself, but you just like repeat, like, scripts and conditioning that kind of is just really fucking old fashioned, you know, guys? Yeah, anyway, I'm just gonna stop rambling, but I'm a bit of like a, a fuck off, you know, mood. But anyway, for anyone who has commented in any of my videos, um, that you guys are amazing. The people that are just like absolutely uplifting me and are just like so fucking here for it. Um, or that are just, yeah, watching me right till the end. I absolutely fucking appreciate you guys. So yeah, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Okay, anyway. So, um, mm. Yeah, so we are off to Swindon to meet a newbie. So this guy, um, um, we've been speaking for a little while, but we've never actually, um, well, arranged to meet. Um, and I think when I first spoke to him on the phone, I don't know, I, I, I thought he was lovely and stuff, but the thing with me guys, when someone gives me unsolicited advice, it's like, ah, I don't recall asking for your opinion, um, right? I just kind of get a little bit like, oh, you've actually just annoyed me, or I feel a little bit annoyed. <laughs> yeah, so uh, this was the case with this guy a little bit, right, uh, at, at the beginning. Um, so I was just more like, yeah, like I'm not here to be, like I'm pretty I'm pretty straightforward with this. Like I'm here for to sexually grow and I'm also here for the money, right? Uh, I'm not really here like, yeah, and also to connect with some, you know, cool people, right? Connect with people and just like learn and conversate, but, I'm not necessarily here like to be mentored or like, you know, advised. Sorry guys, I had to stop recording super quick because my train came and I had to run for the train and I wasn't missing it. Was it gonna miss it? Okay, um, so the quality is gonna be so bad, but I've literally got a light right here. So I was just gonna use it just so you guys can see me a little bit better. Right, so I was saying, yeah, this guy, um, yeah, at the beginning when I first spoke to him on the phone, like the first ever time, I just got like unsolicited advice sort of type of vibes. Uh, but later, now, yeah, no, as I've got to know him, um, like I spoke to him today on the phone and we FaceTimed and stuff. And do you know what? He just seems so fucking down to earth. Down to earth, really mellow, really chilled, really non-judgmental. Um, yeah, like, I don't know, just really open-minded as well. So I thought, you know what, let's go and meet him. Let's just see, um, yeah. And I think he's gonna be more of a long-term person. Let's say if we like really get off, unlike the sex is great, and he loves my pussy, and the asshole, and the mouth. Welcome um, to yeah, the probably, the I, I, I think he's after, I think he's after like something long-term guys, so, which is good for me. Uh, but the only thing is like Swindon. Yeah, we're going to Swindon, it's okay, it's we'll 20. We'll be calling at Swindon, Chippenham, Bath Spa, and Bristol Temple Meets. Okay, yeah. It's it's like 20 minutes from no what 20 minutes on a train from Reading so it's about 30 minute 30 minute yeah distance for me to travel to yeah I think I've just become really complacent because everyone like well the people I've met so like a lot of people are from Reading that I've met so far or like I've liked meeting people in Reading um so I haven't had to travel but yeah so it's not isn't that bad but anyway this guy like I feel like he's gonna be worth the travel because he just seems like I don't know, I've gravitated towards his energy, yeah. Like I spoke to him today, when I was speaking to him today on FaceTime, um, I was just kind of, yeah. Oh, he's the first person I've mentioned that I've been vlogging, like the sugar daddy, with the sex work meets, right? He's the first person I've mentioned, and um, he, I gave him my YouTube as well. I gave him this channel, guys. Um, I gave him this channel, and he has, He's had a look. <laughs> He's looked at some of like the videos and stuff, and I was like kind of laughing on FaceTime. I was like, okay, if I'm gonna give it to you, if I'm gonna give you the like, because he was really intrigued and curious. He was like, I want to see these vlogs now. Um, but I said to him, yeah, if I'm gonna share the channel and you're gonna have access to these videos, promise me, okay, that I, you're still gonna want to fuck me, and I'm, I'm still, I'm still gonna get paid. You know, you're still gonna want me to come out to you. And he was like, yeah, don't worry, I'm chilled. I'm not gonna charge. Like, listen, yeah. So yeah, he's the first guy that I've met off the site that I've actually, I've shared what I am, like I'm vlogging these. Um, yeah, and his take was like, his take on it was similar to mine. He was like, yeah, like you're just sort of sharing your growth and what you're learning and stuff. Um, yeah, so <laughs> I told, I said to him as well, like, oh, what if I, are you gonna be happy that like, I might vlog our meet? And he was like, yeah, as long as you don't share details. <laughs> But mm, yeah, he does seem really cool. Really cool. I think he's like 30s, 30s, Afro I think, I think he was from Nigeria, I can't remember. And he knows the situation with like me being like a little bit more, 
like that I'm not where I want to be like confidence wise and sexually there so he knows that I've struggled to like give people head sometimes and in the past and I've struggled with eye contact and I've struggled with getting on top oh he knows all of that so yeah we'll see how it goes um I've got lube in here and I've got condoms okay yeah mm -hmm. I don't know what else to say I don't know what else to tell you guys um yeah oh how am I feeling <laughs> yeah I'm not feeling that nervous like I think because I FaceTimed him earlier today and we spoke for like a good hour on FaceTime and yeah um, I'm not feeling that nervous if I'm honest guys and I, I think the more you know I've been vlogging these for you guys and you guys have obviously seen everyone who I've met yeah and it's pushed me to get outside of my comfort zone right which has meant that I'm I'm now starting to finally like feel a lot more confident um, with certain things and I'm not as anxious or nervous or like pre-calculating how I'm going to show up during sex, right? Um, yeah, so I'm, I, I can certainly see the confidence start, start, like starting to build, yeah. So I'm like really happy, I'm really happy with that because, uh, yeah, as you guys know, we're about groups over here, we're about groups to get out. Um, yeah. Uh, okay. Mm. I'm basically standing, guys, I'm standing. I'm standing, here I am. Uh, the train is this kind of food. Food. Like we're basically there now, I think we're about 10 minutes away. And we haven't done an outfit of the day either, have we? So I've just literally stuck in like a dress. And I'm wearing flip flops, guys, don't judge me. I'm wearing fucking flip flops, I know, like, not the most classiest attire. Yeah, it's just quite chills, yeah. So literally, literally stole my sister's, like, they're Primark. Primark because it's flip flops. Yeah. And I've also got my sister's dress on as well. Yeah. Um, no bra, okay? No bra. But we got undies on. That's it, and I've got no makeup on. I really just felt really exhausted today after work. And uh, after everything, so I just didn't stick makeup on. I literally said to him on this, I said to him on FaceTime, I was like, yeah, I'm not sticking makeup on, all right? So, uh, expect me to come bare. Yeah, and please don't judge. <laughs> Since there are so many standards for women nowadays, like, to appear like, all, well, you know, I don't know, what's the word? All nice and polished 24 seven, like, oh my God. <laughs> Okay guys, we're here. Oh, hello Swindon, never been here before. Okay, Swindon Station, touchdown. He's just, he needs to try and, try and find out where he is. Yeah, so that way is out. I'm absolutely gonna stop recording now. Just in case if he catches me, he knows I'm recording anyway, but it's just kind of a little bit awkward. <laughs> um, okay, right, we're going out. Wish me luck. I'm coming in with the juice after, okay? Come in with the juice after. Hmm, Swindon. I'm right, I'm still waiting for him. I'm still waiting. Um, <laughs> told me to stand up here. Told me to go up these stairs, guys. Yeah, just a quick update. Oh, is that his car? Maybe that's his car. Is that his car? Is that him? Oh, no. It's not him. It's not him. Hmm. Okay, so we just wait. We wait. We wait. We wait. Um, first time in Swindon. Oh. By the way, so my last train is at 22.41. It's currently quarter past seven. So um, I can't miss my train and I'm not staying overnight. <laughs> I'm not staying overnight. I've got work. I've got a busy day tomorrow. Really busy day. So we just get our sets, get our money, have company, <laughs> have fun. And then we go. <laughs> yeah. Um, but I think I said he wanted to grab something to eat beforehand. But I don't think we'll have enough time, to be honest. Yeah. Is this him? I think this is him. Is it him? No, it's not him. Where is he? Ah. Um, yeah. I made a friend. Say hi. Hello. <laughs> He's looking after me. She's as she's gone in private. <laughs> What's your name? Ash. Ash. Nice. Yes. I'm Cindy. Cindy, it's yeah. Cindy. What do you do? Who, 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 who are you talking? Oh, it's YouTube. Oh. Yeah. Oh, you do, oh. yeah. <laughs> okay, you're shy now. You don't want to be. No. What do you do? Security on train station. Security at train station. That's cool. Where are you from? That's a big question. Can I guess? Yeah. Somalia. No. I'm not from there. Egypt. Wait. No. Where are you from? Guess. You look similar. In yeah. East Africa. East Africa. No. no. I'm, I'm West. I'm, my dad is from Ghana. Okay. And my mom is from Finland. Finland. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice place. Your turn. Where are you from? 
Eritrea, East Af Africa. East Africa. <laughs> yeah, next to Egypt. Next to, oh, next I was to... close. Yeah. Oh my God, I was close. Okay, awesome. Ah? You make YouTube videos? Yeah, videos, yeah. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah sure Probably won't want to know what climb, mum. <laughs> Okay. okay. Anyway, I don't know. Where is he? Where is this guy? We're not going to have long for our fuck sesh. Yeah. I, I feel like with this guy, I'm actually just really going to enjoy his company, guys. Like, I actually real, really enjoy it. Yeah. I feel like it'll be one of them ones where I actually will want to stay with him. <laughs> want to stay and spend time after the sex. You guys know with me, after the sex, I'm like, oh, let's go. <gasps> I can't be bothered to talk. Yeah. But anyway, where is he? Is that him? Where is he? Where is he? Guys. Imagine if I get stood up. <laughs> like in this vlog. <laughs> Reminder. Yeah. Um, we just gotta wait. We just gotta wait. We just gotta wait. We just gotta wait. Wait. Yeah. I'm really in the mood for fucking sex. I won't lie to you guys. I won't lie. Yeah. I'm in the mood. I'm in the mood. Yeah. I've literally been falling asleep like rubbing my clit. <laughs> I'm like thinking of dick like I haven't had sex now I think is it coming up to two months maybe no no not two months what am I on a month it's probably four weeks yeah um I've had no sex yeah but do you know what guys we need to start finding ourselves like regular sugar daddies like yeah or regular people yeah like I want a long-term sort of arrangement or where people are meeting people like frequently yeah um, I think I'm at that stage now where I would like that like yeah, a couple of months back, I was just like, oh, I want to meet as many as people as I can, you know, um, <laughs> enrich myself in like ugh, multiple penises and bodies and people and experiences. Um, but now I'm more like, oh, actually, I wouldn't mind just a few, few long-term arrangements. Um, yeah. Um, hmm. but, yeah. I don't know where he is. Oh my god, am I at the right place? I've been waiting for that ten minutes. Hmm. Yeah. Anyway, hope you're all good though. Hope you're all lovely. Hope life is lovely. If it's not lovely, I'm also here for you. Um, okay, that's definitely his car. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> oh, okay, I'm gonna talk. Can I talk? Okay. <laughs> okay, guys, he's in the bathroom. You can hear me. <laughs> and I've just said I'm gonna start vlogging now. He doesn't wanna be in the camera, but. So this is the hotel we're in. We've just been chit-chatting. It's funny, because he can hear me. He can actually hear me. This is a di different type of vlog, isn't it? We've got a person over there and they can hear me. Usually I'm doing this in fucking secret in the bathroom. <laughs> but, okay, time for sex. Oh, and I'm a little bit nervous. I'm nervous. I told him I'm nervous. I'm like, oh, he's really chilled. I've noticed when people are like really chilled and mellow and I'm like really hyper, it makes me more nervous because I'm like, oh my God, fuck. <sighs> yeah, I'm nervous. <sighs> okay, anyway, so, like, room tour quick, quick balcony right the balcony you guys can see the view nice and green yeah um hmm, not a big fan of the interior here guys like it's a bit it's like victorian style isn't it yeah not a big fan of the interior what is this like four star five star i mean like yeah i'm just picky <laughs> picky interior person like aesthetically um but yeah bed um we've got the curtains over there we've got a cute little dresser thing here and then a walkway and then a bathroom yeah but okay i feel like me and him get along we get along we've been talking for like an hour just chatting about stuff um yeah he's 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 i like i like his mentality i like i like yeah he's gonna watch this this thing hi yeah i like your mentality <laughs> he's cool cool person yeah rare i think he's like a rare breed um okay anyway you guys wish me luck for the sex absolutely fucking shitting it let's see if i get on top and suck dick yeah um he's peeing at the moment i'm done okay bye guys he's gonna come out now <laughs> so we're still at the same location i'm back but the only difference here is is that we've absolutely got a sex set and the sex session has we finished <laughs> we finished okay so 250 right here for you all oh, you can see lots of 50s yeah <laughs> yes hard earned fucking sex money yes oh okay um oh right look at my hair yeah don't even look at my eyelashes yeah i need infills man i need to get my infills out but right let me just try and cover up so i absolutely do not like slip my fucking tit out yeah um so right 
first of all, so we're still here in the fucking hotel room. Time, it is quarter past one right now. Quarter past one, okay. Um, yeah, fucking hell. And we got here at, what, 8 p.m.-ish? Like, quarter to eight. Um, yeah. So, just a quick one. <laughs> so you guys know how it went. I mean, it was fine. Um, yeah, it was a good sex session, but... First of all, okay, so he's, I've kicked him out. <laughs> what is this? All right. I, oh, this is going to sound so bitchy, but we were kind of just laughing about it. It's it's all fun. It's all fun. Like, not serious, serious. But basically, so we missed my train. I missed my train back to Reading. So Swindon, from Swindon to Reading, guys, It um the last train's at like 11-ish. It was around 11-ish, right? But we just got a little bit too carried away and lost track of time. So I missed my train, right? So I'm stuck here now until the morning. Um, yeah. Stuck here till the morning. But basically, it's funny because I chucked him out. I said, yeah, you literally can't sleep here. <laughs> I was like, yeah, you're going to have to go. Because I won't be able to sleep next to you. Yeah. Um, just, I would struggle to sleep next to him, I think. Um, I probably just end up fucking, fucking all night as well. So I just literally wouldn't get any sleep. Um, but it's basically what basically might as well not sleep now since it's fucking one and I have to leave here by five. Yeah, there we go. Sleep out the window and I've got a busy day tomorrow. I've got a really, really busy day at work. Oh my god, I'm gonna be shattered. But yeah, basically it's, so I'm stuck here. That's why I'm still here and we're not like walking back to the station or we're not back we're not at home or anything. Um Yeah. So I feel I feel really self conscious. Does my hair look disgusting? <laughs> so I'm absolutely covering myself up because we're naked. Yeah, we're naked yeah mm. uh but okay so how did it go um we were fucking like fucked a fair few times um it's funny because he's gonna watch this i know he's gonna watch this so yeah he is the first guy out of everyone we've met and yeah we've gone to meet he's the first guy where i've like i've actually enjoyed their company like i've actually we were sat here for ages just chit-chatting and talking yeah I think what we both have in common, we're, we're like fair, fairly curious and we always ask questions and always are trying to learn. Um, yeah, so I don't know, we just got, off, we got on really well. Like we got on really, really well. Literally, literally got on really well. Yeah. Um, and you guys know, like with me, I'm just like, with the majority of people I've met, I'm just like, oh, let's just have the sex, right? You want to bust your fucking nut. I want my clitoris to be fed and I want money. And yeah, let's not talk. Let's see you next time, right? um yeah but with him actually i would genuinely i would chill like yeah like really really friendly man really friendly really down to earth really open-minded really like chilled put me at ease and everything um yeah but anyway so we yeah sex wise i mean so guys ah, you're talking about what sex i have to say share this so i've never squirted before i've never squirted yeah so no one's ever well i don't know if um, uh well Okay, there was a time when someone's dick did make me squirt, but this was like finger blasting squirt. So he absolutely fucking finger blasted me and he, I squirted and it was the most delicious <laughs> sensation. Like, it was so good, yeah. Yeah. So, oh my God, yeah. Fucking hell. My pussy turned into like a water pistol for a second. Yeah, that was great. <laughs> um, yeah, but I think he was saying, uh, well, I think we both were saying after like how I probably could have, probably could have yeah squirted out a little bit more or whatever but i was just a little bit tense because i was wary of the time and i was like oh fuck i don't want to miss my train but i missed it anyway you know ended up missing it anyway yeah oh my god boob 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 um yeah so um what else what else um basically wait, i'm just gonna quickly stick on a towel so i can go with go sit like there or something yeah i feel a little bit uncomfortable here Got a towel on, that's a little bit better. I'm just gonna sit here. Um, it's a bit more comfortable. Um, uh, uh, I don't know, this the fabric in this room, like the colour, the colour combo is just making me feel a little bit like I don't know. <laughs> like, oh, I'm not a big fan of the colour combo in this room. Um, can you guys see me? I feel like the light is still really fucking bad. Oh my god. Um oh, let's go and sit here instead. If we sit here um yeah so what was i saying um he yeah we finger blasted he finger blasted me and i squirted and everything right so that was absolutely fantastic and also guys so you guys i know the whole situation with like the head thing like giving head and how i tend to be like a little bit just to be a little bit like 
I don't know, just quite critical about my head game and I'm just like really self-conscious <laughs> when I give head and I'm just like so up in my mind thinking, oh my God, you could be doing 10 times better. Uh, but yeah, so he, I don't know, he made me feel really at ease. Yeah, made me feel really at ease. So when I was giving him head, this is the first time I've actually felt fucking sexy. Like I actually felt like, I don't know, I was just really in the moment and I was absolutely just fucking enjoying sucking his dick. And I absolutely enjoyed I just enjoyed every second of it. Yeah. I don't know. It was great. It was absolutely great. I've never, I've never sucked dick like that. And in a way where I'm just totally like in it as well. Like I'm just so in it and I feel good about it, you know? Um, and not that I haven't felt good about it before, not because I'm, it's the act of sucking dick. It's just more like I've just been really up in my head and I'm just like, oh, like, yeah, my, like, yeah, I don't know. I've just been really self-conscious about <laughs> my head game. Right, or just like about maybe how I look or like if I'm doing the correct thing. I think that's the main thing. I've always been really concerned about like, oh, I don't know. Yeah, if I'm doing the correct thing, you know, or like, I don't know what I'm doing kind of thing, right? But yeah, sorry, I feel like I can't speak English, guys. Sorry, I'm like really shattered. I had a really long day today. I had a really long day. Oh my God. Um, But yeah, I've, oh, I've really enjoyed like today. I actually really enjoyed it. Um, Yeah, and I was like, really, I've, when I started this vlog, I was just kind of like, I had a shit day at work and like all these fucking comments and stuff, like some of these stupid comments, <laughs> the idiotic comments from some people. I'm just like, oh yeah, whatever. Um, yeah, I was just kind of feeling like really low, a little bit more on the lower side, yeah. But no, I just feel like really, I don't know, it was just nice, like it was nice. I feel like really, yeah, yay, yeah, I'm happy, like I'm happy, I'm happy, like happy, yeah. <laughs> Oh, really? I'm just, I feel like I'm just growing so much, like sexually, it's crazy, man, like in confidence wise, like, yeah, I'm just like, I'm I'm picturing myself now, like when I was sucking his dick, I, we were just like, literally on the bed there, and I was just sucking it, and I don't know, like, oh, it was just, yeah, you know, and then after I was like, okay, give me feedback now, yeah, because, um, yeah, give me feedback, give me feedback about how I did, and what I could have improved, and um, I I was so surprised when he said, yeah, I, like I absolutely could have came from your head game, like, you know, from your oral. I was like, really? I was like really surprised. Yeah, I was really surprised. And he was like, yeah. And then he said to me, like, you, you were just a little bit impatient. Yeah, I think maybe I am a little bit impatient. Yeah. Maybe I expect you to come in like fucking 30 seconds. <laughs> but yeah, guys. Um, but positions, we just, there was a lot of missionary and a lot of doggy. Um, yeah and mm, that's pretty much a sex um oh another thing actually yeah so like this is the first time i someone has allowed me to watch them like wank yeah um yeah so he literally just like was getting off and like so i was sort of lying down right and my legs were just like spread out and he was just like kind of wanking over my pussy <laughs> like, yeah and it was the most beautiful thing ever like i think it's like so sexy watching guys like wank and stuff it's like a lot of the porn i watch is like that um yeah so that was so beautiful like watching him wank oh my god i was like so really was fascinated by it i don't know i was so into it <laughs> i'm like, really into it um yeah so it was, he was like wanking but also fingering me at the same time yeah so hmm. it was a good sex session yeah hands down probably i would say probably so far i've been able to let go the most with him yeah definitely and um fucking now tick 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 for the fucking finger blast yeah oh my god finger blast with a bit of squirting at the end thank you yes please do that again <laughs> yeah but um yeah so definitely would, i'll definitely meet him again hopefully he wants to meet me um yeah and do you know what i think he's just gonna be like a friend i th genuinely think he's gonna be like a a, a friend for sure um yeah, I feel like we just had a really good chat, really good conversation. Mm. He's definitely, he's going to be watching this. So yeah, I'm basically complimenting you. Yeah, I'm complimenting you a lot. <laughs> yeah, but um, cool guy, cool guy. Um, yeah, but all, and before the sex, like we just sort of went for a walk and we had a bit of a smoke up, right? Um, smoke, yeah, and I'm, I don't smoke. I'm not a smoky girl, but I was like, oh yeah, let me have a little bit. <laughs> and I was just like, I absolutely don't know how to smoke, guys. I don't know, I always cough it out. I'm like a fucking amateur. Um, <laughs> yeah, so there we go, we did a bit of that. And then we just came back and we fucked, yeah. Um, but that's basically it, yeah, basically it. Um, mm, really enjoyed myself. Now it's just a matter of like, 
I'm obviously it's basically 130 now it's like yeah okay it's 125 I've got a really busy day at work tomorrow oh my fucking god so I'm a little bit annoyed that I did miss the train um yeah and also I wasn't gonna be like a spoiled little bratty bitch and be like yeah you absolutely need to drive me home now you need to drive me to Reading or you need to call me like an uber like all the way from Swindon to Reading like absolutely not I would not nah nah nah, nah. that's two princess vibes for me um yeah we got our 250 so you know that's fine it's fine it's not the best it's not the best i won't lie to you guys i think there is more in the game but also it's not bad it's not bad um 250 for sexually growing and for learning about yourself and for lots of pleasure and lots of fun you know and just connecting um yeah oh my god how can i forget this part right also when so when he was finger blasting me and i squirted right and it was just quite intense right guys how can i fucking forget this i literally started crying i could start crying i literally started crying <laughs> How can I forget? This is like a massive detail. Oh my God. I was going to end this vlog and not share this with you guys. What the fuck? Yeah. So like, yeah, we were just there in, in the missionary position. He's fingering me, right? And um, yeah, just absolutely finger blasted me. And then I'm like squirting or whatever. And then it was just after, I don't know. I just felt, do you know what? And he came in for a hug after, like he just hugged me um because my body was kind of like shaking um not like shaking in a way where it didn't feel nice but it was like nice shaking like you know pleasurable shaking right um which t i tend to do that a lot yeah i feel like when i've had like really good sex like my legs will just start to like fidget literally um but yeah after i squirted right and then he came in for a hug and i don't know i think it was just like his warm the, the presence of like a human body i don't know it, it just felt really Oh, I don't know. I think I just had a really difficult day today as well. I just had a really shit, shit day. Just generally, like, I don't know. Just I didn't feel as, like, didn't feel at the top, you know? Which is fine, because it's a part of life. Like, shitty days happen. Yeah. Over here, I'm not going to... I'm not the sort of person where it's like, oh, yeah, just, you know, find the fucking silver lining and everything and just switch everything into a positive. Like, we absolutely don't need to do that. I think sometimes there is... Um, there's a lot of comfort in being able to hold like pain right you know everything doesn't need to be switched over into positivity yeah i think um yeah i think one of the best things we could do for ourselves is like increasing our capacity right to hold like pain yeah it's a part of life um but anyway yeah i think when he came in for the hug after he finger blasted me and like yeah and i was square and he came in for a hug i don't know i just like think I don't know, it was just, it felt really intense, but it felt so reassuring and warm and nice, you know? Like, human connection is, like, the most powerful thing ever, man. But, yeah, I just absolutely started crying, guys. I literally started crying. Like, tears, like, flooding out. And then he was just here staring at me. And he was like, are you all right? And we were both just, like, giggling and laughing. And I was just, like, wiping my tears away. He was wiping my tears away. Um, yeah, I don't know, it's just so emotional. Like, I'm even going to start crying. <laughs> He's just thinking about it. <laughs> literally, you know, my eyes are starting to water up. Yeah, I don't know really emotional mm. um yeah but it was like kind of cathartic at the same time yeah like it was i don't know yeah but after that we just chit chatted <laughs> we chit chatted and just spoke and talk, uh, like we were talking for ages and just like, talking and stuff um yeah i just i'm repeating my words now i absolutely repeat my words <laughs> um yeah mm. but yeah that was so nice that was nice like yeah um I ain't fucking complaining. Two fifty. It's like we're talking about money. Oh, that was really nice. Like, yeah. Um, fucking out. Do you know what? I think I'm just like really. I'm 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 in reflective mode now. I'm just thinking like, oh my god, I'm actually just like, I'm really growing like sexually, and it's like it's it's kind of empowering and it is nice because before I started this, guys, I was just like the most shyest like girl when it came when it, when we're just in in the in the context of sex, right? Outside of sex absolutely like out there most like very ballsy and confident right but when it's in the domain of sex i'm just like yeah i don't know just complete switch right which i've spent which i've said to you guys before um but yeah so i'm just like it's kind of like overwhelming when you when you start to overcome your obstacles and you start to see like you know the person you're starting to turn into you and you're starting to change like right um and like your self-confidence bucket over here is like we're just starting to increase 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 um i don't know it's just like it's nice <laughs> it's nice it's really nice yeah um but basically yeah mm, that's it <laughs>
that's basically it yeah so i'm just gonna try and basically get a bit of sleep and then um he just gave me some taxi money to get a taxi in the morning so um he was gonna call me a taxi in the morning um to take me to the swindon train station and then from there i'd get the train back to reading um yeah so but i told him no nah, don't worry about it just send me the taxi number like the, the, yeah send me the number for a taxi company yeah but anyway okay so uh i don't know should i end the vlog here or should we make our way back in the morning um yeah should i wake my should i vlog that when we go back in the morning or should i just end the vlog here yeah i'm thinking i might just end the vlog here guys but um i might put an overlay here of me like leaving in the morning <laughs> i'll do that yeah i'll probably stick an overlay here um yeah uh i've got to feel so rough guys i've got a long day tomorrow oh my god um basically i'm the duty worker tomorrow so like within the mental health team we have like a an allocated duty worker each day which means you have you take any incoming calls for people that are like struggling people that want to kill themselves um people that are just yeah uh potentially uh, you know reaching crisis or just want someone to talk to so i take all the incoming calls for that um you know or any last minute like home visits or yeah or mental health reviews might be thrown on me so i always just like to feel rested on my duty day yeah um but i'm not gonna feel very well i'm gonna oh, i'm gonna be tired as fuck man oh my god yeah anyway don't regret it this has absolutely been worth it um yeah definitely up there in one of my favorite sex sessions 110 percent up there up there yeah and i'm gonna meet him again so yeah um <laughs> absolutely gonna meet him again um yeah but listen price up yeah we want a bit more than 250 because i know you're gonna be watching this so yeah price up yeah um <laughs> i was laughing to him and i was saying to him like yeah do you want to pay for my teeth because i want to get my teeth done and i was like yeah do you want to pay yeah thanks <laughs> without sounding like a fucking spoiled princess um yeah but okay right so i'm absolutely just gonna fucking go now and stop talking i'm gonna love you and leave you guys uh, i'm probably gonna quickly jump in the shower um because I just feel like I've got dick all over me, yeah, and I'm really sweaty, and, um, yeah, I just want to kind of wash the pussy, yeah, um, and we did use condoms, by the way, hope you guys are proud, yeah, we don't want BV acting up again, right, we don't want the fishy fanny returning, <laughs> yeah, um, but, okay, so, thank you so much for tuning in, guys, um, absolutely love you if you've got till the end, um, I appreciate it, like always, and, yeah, stay tuned for the next vlog! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go now. Yeah, I'm absolutely gonna go and fucking shower and sleep. <laughs>